The Pennsylvania State Fire Commissioner was in town today for the Monroeville Fire and EMS show, touting the governor's plan to double funding for the fire and EMS grant to $60 million. Alexander Gone are the days of fish fries and hoagie sales that allow fire departments and first responders to raise money. PA State Fire Commissioner Thomas Cook says the state is experiencing sharp increases in operating costs with no increase in funding. Right now, Pennsylvania is facing two critical issues with the fire service in general. The first one is a funding issue, right? So where a pumper uh, costs upwards of a million dollars now, you know, you, you can't buy that anymore by doing fish fries and hoagie sales and strip tickets. Governor Shapiro is proposing a new budget for the grants to double to $60 million, hoping to update outdated safety equipment and provide additional training. Our grant program is a very important supplemental funding source for them to be able to acquire the equipment and the tools that they need to protect the civilians and the visitors of the Commonwealth. Most importantly, more grant money will help first responders recruit more people in a time where there are few applying. We've seen a decrease in available personnel. So the second critical thing we're looking at in the Commonwealth is the whole recruitment and retention of people. It is a simple application process online to apply for a grant, and the fire commissioner says that they dole out the money equally, and the same process goes to EMS. In some cases, this, this grant is the only thing that pays the electric bill to keep the fire department open. So it, it, is, it is very critical to the future of the fire service moving forward. Alexander Todd, KDK-TV News.